Chelsea Chandler may have created a brand new inventive defensive strategy and that is to run away f from your opponent literally sprint and run away across the octagon <laughs> oh my god i've never seen that before chelsea chandler versus norma dumont so dumont landed a swift i think it was a uh, right straight i think right on the jaw a very close-knit combo after that and then chandler just kind of she got hit and I was like, okay, I'm out. And she just started running away, her back to the opponent, right into the octagon uh, fence and just kind of almost hit her head there. And I thought she was done. I thought Chandler was like, you know what? That, this is it. I'm done. I can't fight her. I'm going to run away, defend, and then just quit. But no. But just some miracle. at the After that, very comically funny moment she just grappled the hell out of her and she might have wandered around i don't know but dumont uh just being the uh, she was just the way better fighter though actually she didn't win the round dumont is just better in every way possible grappling was kind of even that's why chandler i believe survived the whole fight because her grappling was what got her out of there and dumont just yeah it was a straight right and just <laughs> Dumont just ran, sprinted across the uncle. That was pretty funny. I've never seen that before. Uh, the commentators are saying that um, she survived because of that sprinting away from her op opposition, which has never happened in the UFC before. There have been people kind of jogging away, kind of defending themselves by doing that. The best example would be Conor McGregor kind of Running away from Nate Diaz in their second fight. If you watch that fight, that's what he did. And yeah, just, I don't know. New defensive strategy invented by Chelsea Chandler. That's, like, God, that was such a funny moment.